Hi, I'm uh, Brian Fitzgibbons from the Glen Hotel. Originally it was called the Eight Mile Plains Hotel and it was first constructed back in 1863. It's one of the oldest hotels in Queensland. We've had this hotel, my parents before me, back from 1960, so we've been here for over 50 years. The hotel has progressed through those years to brand new addition here, opening within the next couple of weeks, four and a half star accommodation. The Glen is very much a community hotel. We do a lot of catering for all types of socio-economic groups. We cater for christenings, we cater for wakes, we do many weddings per year and we have a number of function rooms and we do a lot of corporate work. We've gone to a lot of trouble to super insulate the building both against sound, noise and also outside temperature so we could get a comfortable environment for our guests to stay in. We've put LED lighting right through. We've put a very latest Mitsubishi air conditioning system in that can vary its, its loading depending on the number of rooms that are being occupied. So all in all, we've done everything that we could to uh, enable the cost-effective operation of the building. A number of years ago, we started to deal with looking at what energy saving devices we can install to try and uh, reduce our electricity bills. And obviously hot water was a huge part of our demand. So we had to look for more efficient heating mechanisms here for the hotel, both for the kitchens and with the accommodation. I've chosen Apricus system because I've recently built a new home and I installed Apricus into that and I have been very impressed with it. So I thought, well, on this commercial project, we'd investigate and see whether commercially we could use Apricus and our hydraulic engineer suggested that it could certainly be done. And so we've installed a very large system here. At the Glen here, we've got 44 rooms. All of that's provided by hot water from our Apricus system. Look, we've been very happy with Apricus and the liaison between us. We haven't had any issues, but if we've got any issues, we're sure that we're partners and we're not just the end customer. And I think that we've got an ongoing relationship because there's a fair capital cost involved in the beginning. When you're putting these energy efficient systems in, you've got to have confidence that these systems are going to do the job for you. You could say, listen, the footprint on the world, but I think at the end of the day, it will pay dividends for us from a financial point of view and we'll, we'll get the rewards of that going forward as, as electricity and all other consumable energy sources continue to go up in price, which they will. You know, there's a world scare and suddenly they double electricity again. You know, you'd be spewing if you didn't put the right systems in to enable you not to be competitive. Because at the end of the day, you know, you've still got to be competitive in the market. We can be very competitive here. That's what we believe.